Hey folks, it's Jim. Uh, I found this Troy built EDAP 16 inch, which I think is one of the better uh, push mowers out there, non motorized, like in the old days. And boy, doesn't this thing work fantastic! Now, I found it free on the side of the road, and uh, all it required was me to clean it up, and I had to pull uh, one of the drive wheels off and uh, clean that and set it properly and then lube the uh, pin the, for the spline gear so it would engage and disengage and that was really it and uh, the thing is running fantastic it's almost brand new as you can see there's no rust on it um, simple clean job and all that uh, and the reason why I'm doing this video is I do the lawnmower bicycle thing and and repair other things but uh, these this is a way for you preppers that are struggling to pay for preps to find something free like this clean it up repair it whatever that may be this was free I put nothing into this to have it running just like brand new okay and it was squeaking and making all kinds of noise when you pushed it when I got it 15 minutes later it's just like it came out of the box okay so I want to let you know that there are fines like this all over the place that you can convert to money to help you pay for your preps. Okay, so you don't have to go broke trying to do your preps. I hear a lot of people complaining that I don't have enough money to do their preps and whatnot. But folks, if you hustle a little bit, you might find that you're pretty good at a couple of things and people may need that service in your area and just being a hustler and finding lawn mowers and snow blowers and all kinds of other things out there and getting them to run again you're saving people money at the same time will help you pay for some of your preps if that's what you need this particular machine i'm keeping because i want the exercise of it and it pushes so easy so beautifully that uh it's probably the best push mower i've ever had and I'm really, I really enjoy it. I already cut two swaths with it and I made the decision, I'm keeping it. And so that's that. And I cleaned it up and there you go. And this machine also retails for $140 at Home Depot right now. That's right. A $140 little machine that will be great in SHTF if the fuel stops running. I can still cut pathways and my lawn in certain areas that I want to cut the lawn. And so on and so forth, can I? I don't need fuel to run this. In fact, I get exercise and I get healthier, don't I? And I have right now nine, ten, now this one, ten lawnmowers, okay? And I'll probably be selling or giving away uh, six, okay? But I'm definitely going to keep this. But somebody out there who's struggling to get money for, to buy their preps, you could have found this and put the 15 20 minutes into it and you could put it out on your lawn and sell it for 50 bucks right now and it will sell easily for that because of how good this thing cuts it's absolutely amazing and a lot of people want non-gas operated things with all the green movement so this thing could possibly even sell for more money as you can see how immaculate it is and it again let me reiterate, it did not take any money for me to make this thing run beautifully, like just out of the box. So, uh, or let's call it, call it run, push. And it's so easy to push. It will give me great exercise, which helps me be a better prepper, right? Because the better my body is, the better I can withstand things, right? So, I just wanted to share that with you. If you're out there struggling, again... To afford your preps, have you thought of taking up a hobby like lawnmower repair, bike repair, something like that, that can help you afford your preps, okay? And if I wanted to, folks, I could easily flip this for 50 bucks. Will I? No, because to replace it is $140, and I like this machine. I've been looking for one, and here I found one. Did I pay for it? No, I went and got it. I hustled. Okay, and my hustling had nothing to do with my regular training bike ride. So I didn't even put a lot of effort into that. It was just basically dropped in my lap. Jim out.